Welcome inside our San Francisco studios. It's inside Pac-12 football, the bowl selection special, a digital edition. Mike Yam, Yogi Roth, Nigel Burton with you. Guys, on the outside looking in is Stanford for a college football playoff consolation prize, which is still a pretty good one. A Rose Bowl date with Iowa. These teams have never played each other before. Your initial reaction to David Shaw's team not getting into the Final Four, but landing in Pasadena. I think it's all right. Look, it wasn't ideal. They didn't get the help they needed. But I go back to last spring, meeting with David Shaw and him talking about his team and really resetting the mindset for this program. The best winter conditioning they've ever had. A team that had gone to BCS Bowl games three previous seasons. Obviously a down year last year. But to come back the way they did this year after week one, to me, showcases the character they have, the leadership they have, and really why he deserved co-coach of the year. I thought it was a magnificent job. I think they're going to thrive in this setting. Oh, no doubt about it. And, and, you know, when you look at these two teams and the way they match up in terms of statistically, it's a pretty even matchup when you look at passing and running. I mean, you break it all the way down. There's no glaring uh, advantage for Stanford, yet there's this feeling that somehow they should just dominate this Iowa team who's going to be really motivated to go into Pasadena and show that, you know what, we deserve not only respect, but maybe we should have still been a playoff team or we were this close, right, yards away from being in. So I I'm anticipating a great matchup. David Shaw's team, it's their third Rolls Bowl appearance in the last four years. Iowa Returning to this game, last time they played it, 1991, when they lost to Lincoln Kennedy. Kennedy's. And that's <laughs> right. Just kind of throw that the one dogs. in there. Yeah, the dogs did take care I of I think business. I just threw up a gang sign, but anyway. For everything <laughs> that's happening around the conference, all you have to do, follow us on Twitter, at Pac-12 Network.